this guy, Muhammad, made all of these gods into one god? How could this be? There's a conspiracy here. Somebody's pushing this man against us. And they tell him, you divided our families. You beat husband against wife, uh, parent against child, and child against parent. This is divisive. Let us live together. And if you insist, we worship your god one day, and you worship our god one day. Thinking that this is a fair treatment. This is a fair division of labor or interest. Like people who argue today and say, Islam doesn't fit to govern or guide in a modern world. We are in the 21st century. Man, this is too old. How could you talk about a book that was revealed in the desert for people who are Bedouin living in the desert and you want to apply their rule from 1400 years back on us today? This is unreasonable. So they start off with a false logic of assuming that old means bad, right? But it's the same people who pay millions of dollars for something just because it's old enough, even if it is a stone. But when it comes to invite them to change, they tell you, no, we are living by established, tested laws. These laws have worked for decades for our nation. Well, the laws of Allah have been working for humanity from the beginning. So in one time, old is bad, right? And you have to be modern. On another time, old is great and magnificent. It's a treasure. And this is how the mind of man is manipulated by the shaitan. He makes something that is worthless, worth all of what you have. And he makes something that is very valuable, worth nothing in your eyes.